Hey, what's going on guys? Johnny here. I'm back with more Shadow Gun Legends. In today's video, we talk about ribbons and medals, more specifically the hidden ribbons. If you click on your profile, you see the list of all your ribbons and the medals. Each medal is associated with a specific ribbon. You have to do these ribbons 25 times, 10 times, sometimes 50 times. At the bottom of the list, there are some hidden ribbons and hidden medals that go with them. If you click on it, it says hidden ribbon experiment to discover new awards. So as we know, there are three naked ribbons. We call them naked ribbons. Naked ribbons mean you have to do stuff naked with no armor using only pistol. This one right here is naked gun 2.0. It says as a squad, clear a dungeon of similar rank, no armor, only pistol. So this one can be achieved in Voltaic Fist or blade dance or whatever i suggest you guys go voltaic fist the thing here is it's a squad ribbon you have to do it as a whole squad naked so all three players should be naked don't use anything else other than your pistol and do not use damage skills like grenades sentry gun am bomb and stuff like that it will kill the ribbon for the whole team that one right here is naked gun 2.5 again as a squad you have to clear the arena with no armor equipped, only pistols. That one you should do in bronze arena, guys. If you try this in silver arena, you might achieve it, but it's gonna be painful as hell. You're gonna die a lot. Now the last one, I don't have it. It's somewhere at the bottom. It's Naked Gun 1.0. It was obtainable in beta. Some beta players have it, but after global launch, it was no longer obtainable because it says, I'm pretty sure it's something like get 30 kills uh, while being naked using only pistols but it's something you should do in campaign missions or operation missions so i'll remove my gear to show you guys what's the deal with naked gun 1.0 so if you remove all your armor you see your power decreasing a lot i'm at 93.5 right now now what happens is if you try to go into an operation mission while wearing no armor the mission is in red it says required power at least 240 to do and this one is 250 suggested but if I try to click on it it doesn't do anything because I'm not 240 you have to be at least power 240 to go into this operation mission and that is why Nikki Gun 1.0 was not possible but with the addition of daily missions after 0.5 we finally can launch a mission even though we don't have the required power and that is very good because maybe now naked gun 1.0 is obtainable so i'll do some tests today for science and we'll see if we can get naked gun 1.0 now so yesterday i did my two daily missions wearing no armor however i was wearing cosmetics and i had my premium ring turn on i did use some skills but only supercharger and the healing station on the other two ribbons you were able to use supercharger and other skills that don't do damage and you were still able to get the ribbon so i remember when we were doing naked arena we were using deflector skin uh, to stay alive mostly and supercharger to deal a lot of damage on elite so yesterday i did my two daily missions with no armor only pistol and I didn't get the ribbon yet, but maybe it's because I don't have 30 kills yet. The mission seems pretty short yesterday and not a lot of enemies, but I was wearing cosmetics and my ring. So I will remove everything today to make a test. So now I'm totally naked. No cosmetic, no tombstone, no nothing. I will also go into the options and turn my premium ring to off. So here's the deal. I will go back to my daily missions. If I get naked gun ribbon early before 30 kills, it means my kills from yesterday did count. So you can use armor and you can use your premium ring. I did also use some skills yesterday. I used the healing station and the supercharger. So today we'll go with zero skills and we see what happened. If I don't get the ribbon early, it means my kills from yesterday did not count. If I get the ribbon after 30 kills today, it means you have to go with zero cosmetics or you cannot use skills so let's go guys all right mission is starting so i'll switch straight to the pistol and let's see what's going on hopefully we can get a lot of uh enemies i will also switch my skills just to make sure i don't make a mistake but supercharger i'll keep and i'll go with healing station here i could go deflector skin also but healing station is just because i try to get the medal for that and i don't have it yet so if i can get some kills with healing station like i said at the start i will not use any skill at all 
So let's try to count also the kills. We can see here two enemies, so that's gonna be two at least. That was three. I might go for a supercharger. There's a lot of enemies. That would be like four. Five maybe even. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. By the way guys, I'm new to using the manual uh, fire. I was using auto fire for like two months. So my accuracy suffers a bit, but it's for the best, I think. There's a lot of good uh, reasons to use manual shooting. So I got like 10 kills maybe at the start. Another thing is, I don't know if you gotta get 30 kills in the same mission. That would be another thing to consider. And some missions never have 30 enemies. There's a lot of missions you you don't see 30 enemies in total. All right, let's see if we can stack some guys and use a good uh, supercharger. There's only like four enemies, but let go still. Okay, so we got like 14 total. That will be like 17 after these three. There's like a... I don't know if he dropped. There was a sniper in the in the vehicle. Alright, so we're at 14, I guess. So definitely my, t my kills from yesterday didn't count. I had more than 15 yesterday, definitely. And I'm at 14 today. Maybe I should not have used Supercharger, but I don't think it matters. Supercharger should, should work. That's like 17 kills at least. <clears throat> yeah, I said I was not gonna use no skills today. I did use supercharger. You should not be voiding the ribbon. At least it works in the previous ribbons. Alright, a good bunch of enemies now. You want some more? Oh, also, I'm not using Gunslinger, guys. This is very hard. Uh, the damage from the Gunslinger is so helpful in Naked Ribbon. So if you just gonna be farming only... Oh my god, I died. So I just died. I don't know if it reset the count, so... I'm not gonna use supercharger anymore, but they reset me here. Maybe it's 30 kills without dying? No, it cannot be. It cannot be 30 kills, 30 kills without dying. If it resets, we need like a bunch now. I want to get that guy. Nah, the hand, the headhunter is keep. Die, dude. I got it! Naked Gun! This is a pretty good mission, guys. There's a lot of enemies on that one. That's it. Now what? Shoot the core to destroy it. You can, if you want, like, don't shoot the core. Maybe they're gonna spawn infinite enemies. We'll see. If I don't shoot the core, see if they spawn infinite enemies. But they are... Like, Stronger ones. I don't know if they're gonna spawn easy ones. Yeah, that's easy. Oh, I got another ribbon, guys. 
Wow, this is great. And you cannot run out of ammo with the pistol, so that's a good thing. Okay, let's count. Two. Six. Seven. Eight. Eleven. Twelve. So let's say... Twenty-two, I guess. Let's go. So that works. That's another 30 kills. So if I wanted, if I really wanted, I could stay here all day and just do like 30 kills. I don't know if it's 10 times. Yeah, I, f I, f I could just farm 300 kills here and get all my uh, my ribbons, but I don't know if it's going to work. I mean, I don't know if they're going to give me all my ribbons at the end. So let's finish the mission, guys. Initiate takeoff. So, guys, moment of truth. When I go back to the hub and I check my new ribbons and medals, will I have my three ribbons? We are back. And you see all the ribbons at the end. I see three Naked Gun 1.0 ribbons. So, let's check the medals and stuff and go straight to the bottom and see what's up. Hey, confirm we see naked gun ribbon get 30 kills with no armor equipped and only using a pistol before i go guys one quick tip the cool thing with these daily missions is you get a lot of quick fame all you gotta do is click on them to claim the reward it's 3.5k fame but if you do naked ribbon don't claim it yet because if you're working on some uh, weapons or armor with some perks that are not unlocked yet you might want to wear them before you claim the fame so i have my embra equipped and you can see there's three perks that are not completed yet so i will always wear that when i claim some fame missions uh, for the armor i'm wearing this one right now because i'm trying to unlock the last perk my crit boots are not finished my crit plants the same thing and i'm pretty sure my gloves are not finished Shoulders don't matter because they're all done. So I'm wearing all my armor and my weapons that I'm trying to unlock perks. And then I'll go claim the fame for the daily mission. Because it's 3.5. You don't want that to go to waste. So final words before I end this video. I did some more tests right after recording the first part. I did my second daily mission naked. But again wearing cosmetics in the ring. Uh, but Because I thought maybe yesterday I didn't get 30 kills. So in this last mission, I got way over 30 kills confirmed. Like I got way, way more and didn't get more ribbons. So definitely something wrong with cosmetics ordering or both. So I will have to run more tests uh, later tonight when my um, daily mission resets. If you guys want to do it before me, make sure you leave a comment below. Um, probably I will try like with cosmetics, but without the ring. But like I said, it's only bugged, I think, in Naked Gun 1.0 because on the other Naked Gun ribbons, we could wear cosmetics, confirm uh, the arena ribbons and the dungeon ribbons. Cosmetics were fine, skills were fine, and the ring was okay too because we did it. All my squad did it. Another thing that's interesting is if you get kills and you die, and then you restart the same part or after the checkpoint, the kills count for the ribbon. But if you die after the ribbon, I'm not so sure because they did fix something after the update to prevent some fame farming, prevent people from killing themselves and restarting checkpoints. So I'm going to guess if you get a naked gun ribbon and you die, if you restart at the checkpoint, do you lose your ribbon? So it's another thing we'll have to confirm later, guys. Again, if you guys have more information, make sure to leave a comment, always reading everything. That will be it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know how you do. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Turn on your notifications. Watch my other videos. I'll be back soon. Take care, guys.